STR Kid Buu has quickly become one of my favorite units to run right now because of how destructive he is offensively and how his defensive capabilities are just such a wild card. It's really fun to run this guy with Reckless Abandon and just see what happens. That's what's so fun about this guy. His 20% heal after taking damage is one of the most fun abilities I think I've run in the game recently. Even though it seems very bland, it's just surprising how much 20% can actually mean on certain teams. So when you take damage and then you suddenly look at your health skyrocketing back up, it's a fun little surprise that just keeps giving over and over and over. So we're going to be running this guy at 79% max links on the collection of epic battles with a pretty stacked team. So as I said, max links, which means infinite regeneration on full display, wall standing tall on full display, every link here, big bad bosses on full display. We're going to be taking on the heroes of Planet Namek Saga. We're going to be running a key plus four, 170% lead Majin power team. This is the best possible lead you could run for this guy right now. And for the friend unit, instead of bringing a secondary exchange boo, I wanted to bring a boo tanks instead because this has some long form event potential. And I don't want to have multiple copies of this guy because he can be a bit of an issue at times. So we have double boo tanks. Each boo tanks can heal at the start of the turn in their passive. So that adds to the whole thing. This guy gains health after taking damage on that turn. This guy heals, not at the, not in his base form, but when he transforms into any one of the three, all of them have a heal factor ranging from 8% to 18%, or 15%. We've also got Bukalo for another 15% heal. Everybody here has infinite regeneration. Everybody here, minus the Kid Buu, has a base passive that provides some sort of a heal. So we are stacked in terms of regen. That, that's the main point. Exchange Boo and Kid Boo are probably the only real questions defensively. This should be pretty fun. As far as the items are concerned, I'm going to bring damage reducers. I don't need to do any healing because these guys can take care of themselves. So let's jump in and let's check out the heroes of Planet Namek Saga. As I did on the last video, it's been a little while since we've run this event. I kind of feel bad for it. So we're going to give this event some love by running through with the power of the pink. All right, so Kid Boo's going first. Unfortunately, he doesn't have power absorption. I hate that. No power absorption means he misses a massive support thanks to Bukalo. So I think I'll have the Boo Tanks here with him because Big Bad Bosses... Oh, he doesn't have Big Bad Bosses until he transforms. When he transforms into Boo Hunt, then he gets Big Bad Bosses. All right, so for right now, let's see how much damage we take on the first level. It shouldn't be a whole lot, honestly. Um, I don't expect this to be... This, should, this will probably be done this turn, honestly. It's been a while since I've done this, but from my last video... Oh, ooh, he nullified, there you go, see? That's what I'm saying. This guy's just so much fun. He's just random and crazy. It's perfect. All right, half a million, N not a whole lot there. We got type disadvantage. We launched multiple attacks, so we gained 90% attack and defense in that one exchange. This guy will probably just take him out. I can't remember off the top of my head which units have unarmed super attacks. So that is going to be a fun little twist in this event. Which units actually have unarmed supers or beam supers? Okay, Bukola should probably... Oh, I guess not. Okay. Where did they... Oh, he's going to heal too. All right. So we'll have uh, South Kai go first. Then we'll have Super Boo and then the Bootex. Piece of cake. 700k. Oh, he's attacking. We're above 80%. This is going to do nothing. 18k. Perfect. I wonder if we heal back health at the end. Oh, yeah, we do. We do. So we took damage and then the fight ended. Do we still heal? We totally do. All right, so now we're fighting Krillin and Gohan. Okay. How many links we got going on here? Four links. Let's have Bootanks. Nah. Let's have Bootanks go second. Actually, what's his deal? Does he do anything specific in the second slot or the first slot? Nope. All right, let's actually have him go first so I can get the full benefit of the links here. All right, so Boo Tanks versus Krillin. Let's have Kid Boo go up against Gohan. And then we'll have Exchange Boo go after Krillin. I kind of want to take some damage, you know? All right, 2.2, we got an additional, there we go. I think it's 18 key boost defense, it's a 12 key that boosts attack, yeah. Huh? That's it, that's all we're taking? Come on, oh my gosh, all right. 
Well, so this is uh, another cakewalk. We'll probably only see our first real competition against the... Actually, wait, who comes up in this in the third fight? Is that Vegeta? I think Vegeta will be our first competition. Oh, this guy attacked three times, didn't he? 90% boost. You love to see it. Oh my god. <laughs> this event is a joke. All right. I know it's not a joke. We're at the second round, so I, I got to calm down here. Goku will be tough. Goku will be tough. All right, Vegeta. T-Pose Vegeta. He is int, so probably the best opportunity to move that tech guy out of here. So let's have Buklo go first, followed by Super Buu. Super Buu does lower enemy attack and defense, so that will help us uh, keep him at bay. Oh, no, he can't have his attack lowered. Yeah, so we can actually take some heat here. This is good. Are we going to get hit or are we going to dodge it? Okay, we're getting hit. 128. All right, solid damage. Now we can see how much health we're going to gain back next turn. We have about 570,000 health. So that's, that's good to know. We're going to try to calculate how much health we can gain back on certain turns. Here we can get at best 5% back. So what is 5 of 570,000? It's like roughly... 35,000? 30,000? Something like that. Let's see. Oh, but then you know what? Oh! <laughs> we're at full health again. We had double 12% heal, so... Okay. There you go. That's the power of the Majin power, folks. Kid Boo in the middle. Double Boo tanks. This one's over. This one ends right here. I should have actually probably gone for the 12 key. Eh, it doesn't matter. 2.2. Additional. Kid Buu may not even go. Okay, 1.5. Kid Buu, 2.4 million attack stat. Not very high. Big bad bosses is a big loss if you don't have that. So, we're rotating out the South Kai of Zorbu, so he should be here by the time we get to the second form of Goku, probably. Oh, he dodged one. That's his first dodge all video. I gave him 10 dodge. You could argue it's probably better to give him more, but at the same time, you kind of want him to get hit a little bit, you know? So, that's a, that's a hard line to to walk on. Finding the, the perfect medium between giving him too much dodge or not giving him enough. Then again, even if you give him full dodge, is that even enough? Because that's only a 25, 24% chance of dodging. Okay, so I guess we'll have Exchange Boo go first. He's got type advantage. Then we'll have Bukalo go second, followed by Super Boo. This is now the this is the mini legendary Goku event inside this collection of epic battles. So this is going to go on for uh, base Goku, Kaioken. Spirit Bomb, Super Saiyan, Enraged Super Saiyan. So five stages. So this is the first one. Okay, good damage. Good damage, exchange move. All right, all right. Perfect. We can walk away from that. Going into next turn, we're going to gain 12%, so that already covers... Yeah, that already covers this. The good thing about this fight is we're going to see all the transformations, too. Super Buu will transform. Exchange Buu might even go to his final form. This will be fun. I haven't seen these transformations in a long time. All right, good. Now we've got big bad bosses. That's the big one. Six links active. Now we can really see Kid Buu shine. Um, I have a feeling Super Buu is probably going to kill. So I'm going to have Kid Buu go first. Then I'll have Super Buu, or not Super Buu, South Kai Buu go second. And I also want to hold off the Dokkan attack a little bit. Alright, so 3 million attack here. Half a million, that's okay. Got a couple more hits in, so that's good. 
And he oh, he dodged. I wanted him to get hit. Oh, and I was right. He's dead. Okay. Kaioken is up next. And we got our first transformation. Here we go. Evil Blue. Uh, is this guy... This guy is Power Absorption, right? Power Absorption. He is. Okay. Uh, he also has a medium chance to dodge. Right? Medium chance to dodge. Reduces damage received by 40%. I want to have him take all these hits. I want to see how much we can heal from this. So let's have him go first. Then we'll have Bukalo go second. Oh, oops. I'm boosting the Dokkan attack gauge. That's bad. Alright, let's see how much we, we get back from this. Alright, there's a dodge. Another dodge. Another dodge. Very good. One point two. Can't expect a whole lot from this guy offensively. He only gains big bad bosses when he transforms into Super Boo. Okay. Again? Is it just me, or is this category quickly becoming one of my favorites? I remember the first time I ran Majin Power, it was against Talon. We had a Super Battle Road race, and sad for my boy Talon, he actually lost to me. And as you guys know, I am the resident trash Super Battle Road player. So losing to me in Super Battle Road is an embarrassment. And he did. And it was mainly because of the additionals and the heals that I got from this team that I didn't have to worry so much about my items. Alright, so we, uh, we took a significant amount of damage there. So we should be gaining it all back basically thanks to this guy. I want to have these two together so we can get the big bad bosses link. So let's do that. Can we actually trigger the Dokkan attack? Oh, we can't. No! No! Alright, well we took damage. So 20% heal is going to be happening. 20%. What is 20% of 570? That's like over 100k. I don't know how much that is specifically. Over 100k. I think it's like 110. Look at that. See that? Our heal. Woo wee! Alright. Spirit Bomb Absorb time. This guy has... Uh... Oh, I thought he was going to be the single bar version. Okay. Uh, Boo Tank. Sure, let's do it. Boo Han is out. Uh, I'm going to have these two on rotation. So let's have this guy go. Then we'll have this guy go. I'm going to skip the Dokkan attack. Don't really want the Dokkan attack to interfere with my healing. Time to get, Time to get serious. serious? Nah, I'm going to take, take it easy. No need. No need for a full-scale assault. 2.5. Very good. Five million. Uh oh, wait a second. What's the final form of this Goku? It's Int. Okay, no, 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 we're fine, we're fine. This guy's wailing on him, man. Relax! Good damage. We might kill him, actually. Half a million again. Very nice. If he gets one more super, we can kill him. No. Alright, back to full health. Once again, another transformation. Um, I think I'll keep one of them as boot tanks. Yeah, we'll just keep one of them around as boot tanks. Uh, we'll just kill him. Bye bye. Bye bye. And bye bye. Look at our attack 1.1 million. 6.7 million attack set in the attack phase. I think he's peaked. I think he's launched all of his attacks. So, yeah, we're... 5.7. All right. Final two rounds. And we are going to be getting another Buhan. So, we have two Buhans. We could have a third one if we want to. So, we've got... I think this guy gives us 10%, 12% heal. Let me actually see. Oh, and we got this too. All right. Everybody has reached their final form. What is this guy giving us? 10% heal. Yeah. 
Everybody here has Big Bad Boss. Oh, this guy doesn't have it? I thought he got Big Bad Bosses. All right, that's fine. So we'd have to have these two together. But I kind of want to have the Super Boot out. I want to see how much he can do. I don't get to use this guy all that often. 50% damage reduction. Let's have this guy stick around. We'll have him stick around. We'll move this guy onto the rotation as well. We'll phase out that Bukalo. Or not Bukalo, Buhan. STR Super Saiyan Goku is no joke. He is dangerous. And uh, we're taking some heat already. If he supers Buhan, we might even lose this. 1.4. Alright, good damage. I guess. Alright, Buhan. Let him have it. One million? That's not a lot. Oh boy. Oh boy. Don't do it, man. Don't do it. Okay, super again. Am I gonna die? Uh, 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 okay. Phew. All right, Kid Boo, final form reached. Kid Boo, how much are we gonna do here? Let's see. Good dodge, ten percent. Let's go, baby. Double digits. Two point six on a non critical. Okay. So we did about three million damage there. I'll take that. I think this guy has a physical no, he yeah, I think he has a physical super attack. So this would have been an, a nullified attack. Or most likely had he launched it. But it doesn't matter, this guy's about to die first thing next turn. And then we'll see the real test be eh! Oh, this could have been totally... Yeah, we could have totally nullified this. Wow. One million on type advantage? Relax, dude. Um, The last phase... Oh, no, 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 no. We're taking this guy out. Last phase is... Is int. So that is a no-no on having tech super boo anywhere near that. Nope. Here we go. 43k. Yikes. That's a lot of damage. I might have made a mistake there. Okay, good. Don't super me. Whew. That was a lot. Alright, one million. And we're done. Alright. On to Int Super Saiyan Goku Full Power. This guy is a beast. You know what that means, folks. It's time for the boss music. All right, Kid Buu and Buhan. Buhan has the Big Bad Boss's Link, so that is gonna be nice. I gotta rotate out the South Kai Absorb. He's too much for this. So uh, I'm gonna have Buhan go first. Then I'm going to have Kid Buu, followed by South Kai Absorb. Let's do this. Oh! Oh, that's also an unarmed super. I could have nullified that. Alright, good to know. If this guy survives going into the third turn, then I will have Kid Buu take the, the burn of the assault. million. Good damage. Good base damage. <laughs> Two million? Alright, cool. There's still plenty of Goku left, Kid Buu. You got this. 6.8 million damage. Or attack. Give me a critical. Don't let Buhan show you up. Again! All right, we got multiple hits in. I guess that's good. We took damage, which means we are about to gain back over 100,000 health from this turn.
That, yeah, dude. That is Majin power. We gained a bunch of health last turn. This turn, literally every single guy here gave us 15%. This guy gave us 50%. This one gave us 12. This one gave us 10. We just got back over, oh my god. Over 30% health. That is just cheating, dude. You know what? Let's just transform. Let's let's do it. Final four Majin power versus this this fool right here. Uh, I should probably have him attack at the end. We might actually kill him here. It's very possible we do kill him. So I'm gonna have Bukula go first. He has a chance to dodge. Then we'll have Buhan and Buhan. I don't even think we're gonna be able to have the Kid Buu come back. All right, good dodge. Good, 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 good. good. No criticals, relax. Okay, good. Only one attack. No critical, please. All right, cool, thank you. Wuhan, 6.4 million attack stat. No! No! <laughs> too strong, too strong. Well, there you have it, folks. Leading the charge when it comes to massive regeneration is the Kid Buu. He has the highest heal factor on the team. 20% is a lot, as you saw. 100,000 plus health gave uh, came back to us after just getting hit once. So you combine that with all of these other heal effects, and your team, as long as they can survive, they are in the fight. So at best, all you need is a damage reducer, which we didn't even use. This team is so much fun. There's no real... You can just throw caution into the wind, basically, on most events. Obviously, certain events, things would have to be a little bit more carefully thought out. But for the most part, this unit and this team is very fun. And I had a whole lot of fun showing that team off in this video. Guys, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a like down below. Let me know in the comments, what do you guys think about this Majin Power team with that Kid Buu as the focal point? Do you like it? Do you think that it's still too unpredictable, too dangerous defensively? Have you guys run this type of a team? And if so, what event have you run it on so far? Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Also, be sure to subscribe for more dope content in the future. And click the notification bell so that you let YouTube know you want to see more of my stuff. Do it. Thanks again. Stay tuned. And always remember to dokon responsibly.